mother's knee, we are truly grateful. Manet and Bill Kane and their three children live in Virginia. Just 41 years ago, they would have been breaking the law. In Virginia, it was illegal to marry someone of another race. Now, 10-year-old Gabriel sees a man from a mixed marriage running for president. I think he's really cool because he looks kind of like me. And um, <laughs> if he's elected, I feel like I could be elected to president, too. They have something else in common, too. His mother is from Kenya, just like Barack Obama's father. And his parents, like Barack and Michelle Obama, went to Harvard Law School. But all those things in common aren't that important to 13-year-old Veronica. I don't really relate to him solely on the fact that he's like black, half black, half white like me. I'm very impressed with everything that he does, you know, he's a very smart person and you hear him speak and you get really inspired. Her sister Cynthia explains it this way. Kind of think of his race as kind of a side note, like he's a great person and he's also African American. Mm -hmm. Like if I didn't like his policies, but he was African American, then I wouldn't like him, you know, because mm -hmm. I wouldn't like him as a person. Mm -hmm. So the race is important, but not as important as what he's going to do. You know, I started to tell my children a long time ago that, you know, you, it's hard for you to even imagine what this means, because for me, it's such a huge thing. And I mean, in a way, it, it's a testament to how fortunate they are that it's not as huge a deal in many ways for them as it is for me. But I'm telling them, can you imagine that, you know, this person, you know, who has a parent who's from Kenya, who's African American, you know, who has this very strange background, is able to aspire to the highest office in this land and will probably get there. And for me, that is just such an enormous thing. Bill Kane says this election is a lesson for Veronica, Cynthia, and Gabriel. Well, I think it's a very concrete example of uh, how it is that, you know, they, they have basically limitless opportunity. Proof, he says, that his children live in a country that is rapidly and profoundly changing. Jill Doherty, CNN, Arlington, Virginia.